Despite only being prominently featured in two episodes of Lilo and Stitch the series, the girlfriend of Stitch has become one of the most prominent characters from the franchise in merchandising with pins, plushes, toys, and bags, even surpassing the prominence of Lilo in stores. On my last Disney trip, I noticed Angel's huge merchandise across Disney parks and stores. Unfortunately, I didn't get any, but I later found out she has even appeared occasionally in Disney parks around the world, which is insane. Years after Lilo and Stitch the series has concluded, Angel has remained. But who is this character who's so adored? Is she just a pink stitch? What is her story? Hello, I'm Isaac from Watso. Hello, I'm mm -hmm. Isaac from Watso Videos, where we discuss fun topics for fun people, and today we will be diving into Lilo and Stitch to explain Angel's full story. If you'd like to learn more about Angel after the video, I've provided all the links to the movies and the resources I used in the description. And to continue discussing Disney with me, make sure to subscribe and to click that notification button. Although in real life, Angel was designed by Chris Sanders, the director of the original film, in the show, she was created by the evil genius Dr. Dr. Jumba Jukiba with funding by Dr. Hamsterville under the name Experiment 624. Much like Stitch, Angel has black eyes, long ears, a flexible skeletal system, retractable arms, and pads on her hands and feet that produce a sticky substance that allow her to walk on the walls and ceilings. She has been shown to possess some strength and dexterity and is extremely durable with the ability to resist heat, toxins, and water since she can swim unlike Stitch. While in real life, Stitch inspired Angel's design, in the show, since Angel was Experiment 624, this indicates her composition actually contributed to the architecture of Experiment 626. But while Stitch's primary function was to cause chaos, Angel was created for a much different purpose. Angel's primary function is to turn the people and experiments from good to evil with a siren song. <laughs> Going from Tantalog to English, her song translates to mean, Heed me, you are in my power. Henceforth, nothing shall be too cruel or too abominable for you to do. You cannot escape. Oh, pretty dark. By listening to Angel's song, any person or experiment created before her will succumb to evil. But when the song is sung backwards, it has the opposite effect, turning evil people good. With an experiment like this, Jumba could ensure he and his experiments would remain evil for eternity, or he could do the exact opposite. To understand my thoughts on why Jumba created his experiments, check out my video on that topic in the description. At some point after her creation, 624 was deactivated along with the other 624 experiments before Stitch and was smuggled to Earth by Jumba during his original mission to capture 626. While on Earth, 624 was reactivated and recruited by Gantu to eradicate Stitch. This mission is when we first meet her. 624 lures Stitch to her to seduce him, and it for sure works. From the first friendly lick, Stitch fell madly in love with 624, who he calls Angel. Now, I have seen some concern about Stitch falling in love with his cousin, but I can assure you it's not a big deal. In Hawaii, referring to another person as cousin, sister, brother, aunt, or uncle is meant to show a sign of respect and create a sense of community, even with people they aren't necessarily related to. I think Lilo and the experiments refer to each other as cousins less because they may have similar genetics and more because they all share a common background and share a feeling of family. So it's totally cool that Stitch falls in love with Angel, whose name is a reference for Stitch to a being from heaven. And a likely reference for the creator to Elvis's You're the Devil in Disguise for Angel was playing Stitch. Talk like an angel. Lilo goes to Jumba to find out what Angel's primary function was. Angel turned Jumba evil, allowing her to gain access to his experiment database and begin to turn all the experiments that had become good to evil again. Throughout her journey across Kauai, Stitch continued to follow her until he was finally lured to Gantu's new ship with all the evil experiments on board. Stitch was in an ambush and faced certain doom until Angel looked inside herself and realized she cared about Stitch too. Angel turned the experiments back to good. They halted the launch of Gantu's ship and revealed their love to Lilo, but unfortunately, Angel was captured by Gantu. 
in a Game Boy Advance game, Lilo and Stitch 2, Hamster Veal Havoc, Dr. Hamster Veal does re-evil her again, which seems unlikely since she does love Stitch, but regardless, by the time Lilo and Stitch plan to rescue her at the end of the series, she is good again. Lilo, Stitch, and a variety of experiments launch a rescue mission to free all the experiments Gantu had ever captured, including Angel. But during their mission, they were caught due to the plan wrecking experiment 120, aka Snafu. All hope seemed lost until Angel's love for Stitch gave her the strength to break out of her containment orb and to narrowly free Stitch and the others. Stitch and Angel could finally be together and they were ready to protect one another no matter what until the Stitch anime. In the anime, it is shown that Angel has become an international and later intergalactic singing sensation. While she's still dating Stitch and is madly in love, she kind of becomes a spoiled celebrity with a decade of fame underneath her, leading to her falling for other experiments at some points, definitely putting some strain on the relationship. She falls for 627 when he pretends to be a charming duke, and she falls for Reuben when Hamsterveal boosts his confidence. But in all of the cases she faced, she always learned they can never care for her as much as Stitch did. Angel recommitted herself to Stitch, gave up her cruel celebrity persona, and from that moment on, she has never been willing to give up Stitch again. Experiment 624 was created to be a siren for Jumba to always lead his experiments back to evil, but love turned her away from that purpose. There seemed to be times she may have turned away from being good and being with her true love Stitch, but every time she would, she would come back and do what she felt was right for herself and her Ohana. Angel is a pink version of Stitch with a unique power, an equally complicated path to good, and who is now the happiest experiment in the galaxy now that she is with Stitch. I hope you feel a bit more filled in on this Lilo and Stitch the series character, so next time you see her plush all over a Disney store, you'll know exactly who she is. Before you go, I just wanted to say I appreciate you checking out this video, and if you are new to the channel, welcome! I am a huge Disney fan whose focus in life is to spread magic like Disney has done for me. If you enjoy this video or any of my videos and would like to help the channel grow to infinity and beyond with more merchandise shows and more, then please consider checking out my Patreon page at patreon.com slash videos and check out some of the awesome reward tiers like the Watso Discord server where you can come talk to me and other fans or make a donation of any kind. I want to continue to keep my videos available for free for everyone, so a couple of bucks to spare goes a long way to help the channel be the most magical show on the internet. Thank you for donating, but most importantly, thanks for watching. So now it's time for the question of the day, sponsored by my patrons. Do you like Stitch and Angel together? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section, along with any other ideas you have for future Discovering Disney episodes. If you'd like to see more Watso videos, then check out some awesome pics over here. And as always, thanks for watching and have a magical day.